Good morning, me again. <laughs> oh, long time no see. I know, it's been ages, guys. <laughs> um, we are going back into Universal Studios today. We forgot to buy one. We didn't forget it, it was just a bit stressful. We couldn't make a decision. We couldn't make a decision. We didn't know whose one we wanted. We then decided we wanted Lucius's wand to only then discover you can't buy Lucius's wand anymore. So then we had to re decide, and I think we know who we're going to get whose ones we're going to get now but today is our dinosaur day so that means Ross coaster if we're brave enough or in the queue's okay enough and the water ride yeah river adventure cool. and also meeting the raptor yeah, the <laughs> which <here>. is <laughs> mum's terrified for <laughs> but that's going to be really exciting so we're going to hop the scariest bit what meeting the raptor yeah even more than Ross coaster yeah on I the roller coaster, that. a velociraptor doesn't jump out and attack you, does it? <laughs> That's fair enough. <laughs> well, actually, it might do on the ride. I don't know. There's an inside bit. Oh, is there? Yeah. Oh, I did not know that. Yeah, so actually... Oh, it could be attacked all day being attacked. Attacked, <laughs> attacked from all angles, basically. Yeah. Um, so, yeah, we're going to get an Uber now and head into... Universal Studios Park today. We, yesterday we started at Island of Adventure. So today, yeah, we're gonna start at Universal. And we think we're gonna start with Men in Black, but we'll see what the ride queues are like when we get into the park. But we will see you in there. Queue today is pretty nuts. Wow. Starbucks to start the day. What? First Starbucks. Our first Starbucks of the trip. Yeah, that was from Walgreens. That was good. How cute is Orlando mug? King Kong on it. And Jurassic. Rip Ride Rocket. Islands of Adventure. So cool. K Pops. Got my hands on a strawberry acai, acai, however you say it. Mum's got a white chocolate mocha. I've also got a cake pop. Yum. First ever strawberry acai. Oh my god, that's so good. <laughs> I understand the hype now. It's very sweet. Very up my street. Mm. Yeah. Very good. My cake pop. Yeah, good right. Mmm. But this is cake on a stick. <laughs> no, it's like it's cake, cake on a like, stick. Like cake batter. Oh god. It's like. Oh my god! It's like my my dream. It's an uncooked cake on a stick. It's an uncooked cake on a stick. <laughs> uh, my literal dream. This is great, so great. We found blue. Yay. Oh, big grown up blue and little blue. <laughs> oh, I might get that for, but oh, I keep saying that, but she's just gonna destroy it, isn't she? Ah, ah, ah. Yeah, got the Mardi Gras merch. Just checking out the Universal store. Oh, there's all t shirts there, Mum. What does this say? It's a sexy bald guy. Just another sexy bald guy. <laughs> Party animal. <laughs> Donkey is whispering around. Wizarding dad, wizarding mum. Oh, get a wizarding mum t shirt. <laughs> we don't do magic shirts. No. I'm thinking waffles. <laughs> Mr. Wonderful. <laughs> oh, we've got Jaws ones there as well. This to her. Mum, look. Oh, E.T. I used to have an E.T. <laughs> oh, oh E.T. with a hoodie on. <laughs> I'm a flag for his room. <laughs> look how cool. The Harry Potter Lego. I'm obsessed with this. I bet it's ridiculously expensive, but I'm very obsessed with it. Like I need it. Oh look, they've got all the t-shirts. Oh my God, they can have Slytherin stuff. 
The Chamber of Secrets, which is my favourite Harry Potter film. Oh my god, obsessed. Oh, so cute. Got all the ones here, and who they, who their owner is. Mum's just testing out Fleurs. It was her favourite when we saw it online. Yeah, what are you, what are your thoughts now? Is that Victor Crumbs? Yeah, look, he's got a head of a... Oh, it's got a head of a th something. It's got a head of a thing on. Yeah. It's Victor Crumbs that one. Nice. That was the one you were leaning towards, isn't it? Narcissa Malfoy's. Yeah. Oh. Leaning towards that. I was leaning towards that. Yes, this is the one I like. Yeah, this is the one I'm thinking of, Narcissa's. Feels like a pretty good fit. Oh, I'm on team picture with her one. <laughs> yeah, I'm liking this one. I'm liking that one. I'll flick through. I'll yeah, spot like Bellatrix. Oh, whose is that? Oh, Death Eater skull. It's Bellatrix's one. Quite heavy, actually. A bit heavy for me. Yeah, maybe that's not the right one. Well, why don't you try out Lord Voldemort's, Mum? Try out Voldemort's. How do you, you feel about that? I wouldn't. I'd expect it to be more pointy. <laughs> oh, I see. <laughs> Not quite pointy enough, so that's a no. No. That's a no. Oh, yes, we've got the other ones here. It's a shoehorn as well. Oh, it's a dual purpose. So it's Nicholas Flamel. He's the um, the guy who has the Philosopher's Stone oh. to help him live. What about Harry Potter's? My initial thought was Ron, Ron Weasley. Weasley. What are your thoughts now, seeing Ron's? <laughs> <laughs> now, now you're holding. Now you're holding it. Now I've got Ron's wand in my hand. You have. <laughs> now you've got Ron's wand in your hand. How do you feel about it? <laughs> I mean, it feels quite good. Ah. <laughs> Okay, so modelling the latest in oh, slithering. Ah, oh. how cool! Ah, oh, so slithering. That is amazing. And look at all the slithering goodies. So much slithering. Goodies. Oh. God, you could really get carried away. I oh, can't. Yeah, I'm just being. Oh, I am right now. <laughs> God, imagine that. <laughs> we get as carried away as I am. I am um, right now. Entering Universal Studios, and off to go buy our wands in Diagon Alley. Monsters Cafe. <laughs> yeah, we got Jimmy Fallon coming up. Rip Ride Rocket there. No one's going round at the moment, but they were twirling a minute ago. As you can see, a very busy park day today. We've got the Mardi Gras theming out there. The flowers. They've got all these Mardi Gras booths as well, all the food booths. We've got them down there. The Jester. Oh, holiday shop! Oh God, no. <laughs> How pretty it all looks down there. Universal is so underrated as a like yeah. aesthetic, cool park. Like all these like old school like streets and stuff like that. Oh yeah, got another this a Bloody Mary's Mardi Gras booth here. Jaws. Okay, so here's Charlotte. Oh, let me try and get the whole of Jaws in. He's a very big shark. <laughs> okay, close up of Charlotte's gone inside Jaws. I don't know where she's gone. <laughs> Getting the ocean attack. Yes! Oh, 
first ones. And this is who I'm going with. Narcissa Malfoy. So now I'm just going to pick the prettiest box. That's Voldemort, Snape, Death Eater, Mama Pink or Molo too, the, good, the goodies. That's Death Eater, unless you want to go be the Death Eater wand. <laughs> yeah, your wand might be... Is that, no, is that Bellatrix? Hmm, it's like you're doing magic with your phone. <laughs> I bought my first wand. We're just sitting on the steps working out how they work. Sitting underneath the dragon with a beautiful view across Diagon Alley. A very busy Diagon Alley today. Hmm. So we've got it all. Sounds very complicated to me. We've got Narcissus wand. Yeah, we're in Diagon Alley. There's one in front of the dragon, apparently, on the map. According to the map, and then I think there's one on the corner as well. But to be honest, we can probably just follow what other people are doing. We might just copy people. Yeah, good plan. We're heading down Nocturne Alley. <laughs> Ready to do some magic. My wand. Ooh. We're in Falcon and Burke. Creepy. There's a bit in Harry Potter when he's when um in Half Blood Prince when Drake they're watching Draco come in here and he goes, What's Draco doing in Morgan and Burke's browsing for furniture? He goes, Dun and then Ron goes, Dunno, he's a creepy shop, he's a creepy guy. <laughs> oh mum the hand. The hand. He just moved. You can hear the birds in the vanishing cabinet. where me and mum are headed for lunch. Moe's Tavern. <laughs> Jebediah Springfield. Lad Donuts. Long old queue for that. Crusty Burger. Central Park down there. Pretty. Oh. Yeah. We were going to go to Crusty Burger but the queues were just ridiculous. Everywhere's just really, really, really busy today. Like, no matter where you go, even the ET, which was a 25 minute ride this morning, is now like over 70 minutes. So, our best bet is to go grab some lunch on City Walk and sort of hope that the crowds yeah. die down a bit and then come back in later. Yeah. Because, yeah, like, the, the queues have been insane all day. We haven't been able to get on anything because, unless you want to queue like an hour minimum. We have got one today. Huh? We have got one. We did get ones and we have done tricks. And what else have we done? We've done something else. Oh, we've done Jaws. We've yeah, done the Jaws. Cocktails. Better shark cocktails. But yeah, it's just so, so busy today. So the best thing we can do is just have another break. 
<laughs> have a food break and then come back to it because yesterday evening the ride queues were all really low yeah so that's probably our best bet and then hopefully we can get some express passes tomorrow oh yeah eating my own hair <laughs> which will just mean that we can get on everything or everything walk on um so that's what we're thinking at the moment because it's been so busy these past few days we've been here and we happily queue like the time that we've queued for the Harry Potter rides. Yeah. But for everything else, when it when we know it's like a 20 minute wait usually, it's just not not worth it. So yeah. Just the view. Out on the lake. Yeah, we're gonna walk up to City yeah, Walk. Sit down, and have some lunch. sit down, have some lunch, take a breather. Beetlejuice. Mum's terrified of Beetlejuice, but look at her getting a picture of him. <laughs> Pretty! Marilyn Monroe! <laughs> Alright, uh, which one you got? Well, it feels like a gazillion years later. I got my orange chicken and noodles. Mum's got her BK Whopper. And we're just sat in the. Hey, everything takes long. Yeah. Probably would have been quicker to queue for Frosty Burger. Honestly. <laughs> But it was so so long. Yeah, I actually think it would have been quick to keep Frosty Burger in the end, but we learnt our lesson. And then Bend the Bow, which I didn't even realise was on the corner here, is no cure all. And they've got really yummy bow bun options. So if you do come here, go to the bow bun place or just queue in the park because you're going to have to queue somewhere anyway, especially on a busy day. But I'm going to eat this now because I'm starving. Hungry. We've got our ones on a date. <laughs> Although mum's bag is um, wand, blocking. wand blocking them. They were on a date there. We put our drinks next in front of them as well. <laughs> they were on a little date. We've all come back to our favourite Fat Tuesday frozen booth on the lake because ride queues are just ridiculous. Big times are just yeah. absolutely ridiculous. No, I don't like it. no. Really no. too long and it's nice sunny weather. So we thought we'll just chill, have a drink. We know that the queues are going to get much shorter in the evenings anyway. So we're better to wait, and then we can just quickly whip round, do all the rides we want to do in Universal Studios, and then have a chilled half evening. Drunk. Half drunk. Yeah. Half drunk. Oh my God, so it's it's alcoholic drinks. Drink. Yeah. It's a frozen, frozen, fr frozen, frozen yeah. beverage. <laughs> I know. Ah. Oh. Do some cool art on yours. <laughs> answer that is no. Oh, what's that? Scribble. <laughs> <laughs> oh, fancy, I like it. <laughs> no, thought you, but it looks a bit like the genie from Aladdin. I don't know how I managed that. Yeah, I thought it looked a bit like the Death Eater symbol, actually. <laughs> yeah, they frosted right up. Frosty Jacks. Frosty Jacks. Yeah. No tutors and no shooters. Tutor and shooters. It's a bit cloudy, but the sun is still there oh, and it's still pretty hot. Chances, I've it all over again. Oh no! <laughs> oh, at least it's not in your spirit jersey this time. No. Did this yesterday. Same thing. <laughs> Except serviette. Oh, I came prepared this time. Knew, knew it was a possibility. I am the spiller. <laughs> Yeah, there was a couple over there that did spill their drink. Up. That's the issue. Yeah, they are, especially because um, when they melt, they just start going liquidy liquids. Oh, so yeah, mad. Going, mad. going mad, I tell you, mad. <laughs> right, I'm gonna oh, drink look, this. The dates, the dates. Oh, cute. <laughs> Leaning into each other there. It's really romantic. The sun, <laughs> lake in the background. Yeah. <laughs> oh, you guys. <laughs> <laughs> About to do Fast and Furious. Play battery. <laughs> first ride of the day, it's six o'clock and we can't the first ride. And we had the crazy cocktails before, hang on them. 
I think we probably queued up longer for our lunch than we will on this ride. Yeah, agreed. I've heard mixed reviews. Some people say it's shockingly bad. Some people have said they actually enjoy it and think it's good. So we'll give you our verdict when we get off. But I feel like we've pretty much, we, well, we've enjoyed all the rides we've been on so far. So I think we're quite hard to, <laughs> hard to disappoint. Yeah, hard to disappoint. Us. More easily, please. <laughs> <laughs> Up there is the head of our family, Mr. Dom Toretto. Come on in, everybody. Make sure you clear those doors in the back. Now, Mr. Toretto's not here right now because he is out racing. He's always racing. He's always winning. And when he wins, he wins the other person's car. And that's where a lot of those cars came from. You can see out there are cars that he has won in races. Come. Okay, uh, perfect. Then these people can go on their way, I guess. And then, oh, Dom is calling. Do you have any questions? I got this, Jamie. Okay. Dom, what up? Just got a heads up from Hobbs. The FBI is about to read your location. Return is possible. Also, all partygoers must have their own seat, including young children. And be sure to secure all those items once seated. Finally. So, what were your thoughts on Fast and Furious? Yeah, I liked it. It was okay. I don't know. I get why people slagged it off because I think a lot of people thought it was going to be a fast racing. Like literally driving a racing car. Yeah. Whereas it was much more. <laughs> it, I, I suppose know, it, was, it was good. I suppose it was themed more to the new films rather than the original. The originals. Yeah. See, I don't like it when bloody what's his face joins cast. Dwayne. The oh, so you liked The Rock? Don't like The Rock. No. Oh what? I no, think no, I liked The Rock. I take that back. I okay. Like, I like The Rock. But I love Fast and Furious, which means I love Vin Diesel. And I heard that Vin Diesel and The Rock didn't get on at all, and The Rock was a bit of a dick to the Fast and Furious family. Right, okay. I.e., Paul Walker, um, what's the face? Who plays Mia? I know who you mean, Mia. Mia. No, I know the actress, what's she called? Jordana Brewster. Uh, and all them lot. <laughs> and all those lot. All those so that put me off. Oh, yeah, yeah. So, so I was more than diesel. Fair enough. Yeah, I thought it was because I'd seen vlogs of people go on it and the people say, oh, it's rubbish or it's this or that. It was better than what I was expecting it to be based on what people have said. So if you've heard it's not good, I think you'll find it better than what you thought. Yeah. But we queued for maybe like 30 minutes, no more than that. Because luckily the ride, the ride times have gone down now. Our first ride is this long at night. But now the ride queues of the rides we wanted to go to in Universal have died down. I wouldn't queue any longer than that for it. But it was, it was decent. It was on my list. It was on my list and we've done it. It's been ticked off the list, so, so what can you say? I would like to see a bit of Paul Walker. Yeah, but I suppose if they did it with like, they re they filmed it, yeah. they, would have, they wouldn't have been able to obviously have him in it, unless they took bits from the film. Yeah, that's what I mean, they could have showed a bit of a tribute, but... Oh, you would have liked a tribute? I would have liked a tribute to Paul Walker, just like helping Diesel named his daughter after him, which is so sweet. Okay, <laughs> fair enough. Fair enough. Getting a bit deep. Getting a bit deep. Um, <laughs> uh, yeah, we're just gonna, I think, wait for a little bit of lower queue time, but we're gonna head over to Simpsons and hopefully do Simpsons and Men in Black because they're the three, well, some of the three we had on the list today, and then ET as well. Hopefully, if we get all of those done, and I think that's all of the ones we wanted yeah. to get done today, we'll be happy. So, on to Krusty Land next. Here we go. Oh, mum, this floor's really bouncy as well. Go on it. <laughs> no, that one, not oh. this one. <laughs> oh, it's bouncy. It's pretty bouncy. Go on, bounce. Bouncy? <laughs> oh, can you take a smell splash more? <laughs> That's when I went on with that um, family and the grandma, <laughs> the grandma was like cracking up with me. Oh, pretty. Pretty. 
In the Simpson shop, the Duff merchandise, Krusty Land. I really like the Santa's little helper toys. I think they look like Buffy. But we are inside the Quickie Mart. <laughs> Thank you, come again. Just did Simpsons. Is it as good as you remember it being? Yeah, I do like the Simpsons. It is such a good ride. And now we've planned this perfectly. Men in Black is a, I think, 30 or 35 minute wait. So hopefully by the time we get there, yeah. So now we're going to do Men in Black Alien Attack. Woo! And we haven't done this in years. No. Since like over 10 years ago, so this is really exciting. Wind's gone real tough now, it's nice and warm. We just did Men in Black. Our photo is hilarious. That um, scores are pretty awful. Yeah, scores are awful. There's a guy next to us who's been on it four times, one after the other, and him and his wife have gone single rider and they were competing against each other. And the, <laughs> because of him, we managed to get average <laughs> score. He got 130. No, 311,000. Oh. I got 40,000. I got 50. <laughs> It's so good though, it's such a classic ride. Oh, and Even combining our scores together, we got less than half of oh, what he got. <laughs> yeah, he's oh, the, look at the pig, look at the pig. Oh, it's Harry Potter. Oh, oh I love this pig. It's not spider pig anymore, it's Harry Plopper. <laughs> oh. It's so cool lit up at night, all this Simpson area. So cool. Right, we are heading now to ET, another classic, and then that's completed our list of rides we wanted to get on today. And then hopefully, depending on the queue for Transformers, we might be able to get on that as well. And Minions, depending on that queue yeah. as well. We'll have to see, but um, walk around to ET now. So excited going on ET! E E.T. is very cute. Experience the mystery. E.T. adventure. I've been so excited for this. Me and Mum have just been given our intergalactic passports. Now we're heading in to help save E.T. <laughs> right now coming out of E.T. <laughs> Memories. Oh, candles. Well, that will smell like the um, the green planet. Oh, it does smell like the green planet. Someone's put their fingers in it. Oh, green planet. No, oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> Look at this. Oh my god, you can have your picture taken Yeah, I, t I told you that. You can have your picture taken with E.T. Mum, do you want your picture taken with DT? <laughs> you don't? What? <laughs> oh. Welcome home. <laughs> oh, no, I think we should have our picture taken there. No, so you'd be like pressured to buy it and we don't really want to do it. What? You don't? <laughs> Which is it? <laughs> oh. That was so good. E.T. is such a classic ride. And because we went on it when we were younger, it's just so many memories, like even the smell, the queue and everything. Oh, it's so good. It's such a good ride. And I really, really want to get one of these for Buffy. She'll chew its limbs off within five seconds, but it's so cute. It's 
SpongeBob store pants. <laughs> Just walking past this on our way out of the park. Brilliant. We are now back home, which is why my hair is doing this. And we've got our Cinnabons and they're warm. Yeah. We've got, oh, turn this baby around. Yeah, proper nice view of these bad boys if I can open them one handed. And we go up. Uh, so we got a caramel and pecan one. And we got a da 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 grand reveal. God. And a classic. And they're warm and they're so gooey. Oh. Yeah. We were too full from lunch, so. Um and the queues are ridiculous coming out of Universal. Wow. Oh yeah, you wanted to get a donut, didn't you? Yeah, I wanted to get a voodoo donut, but the queues were that ridiculous. Looking for a knife and or not a fork to a knife. No, a fork. <laughs> <laughs> Looking for a fork. A knife, no, a fork, no, a knife. To eat them with. They're gooey. Got some. Um yeah, the queues are ridiculous coming out of Universal because it was the time everyone came out. So instead of like the seven or six or eight dollars we normally paid oh, to get back to our hotel from Universal, it was 33 because of how busy it was. So that was the first we, time we've we left. Yeah, that was the first time we've left on like park clothes, and that was a big mistake. We've learned from that now. We won't be doing that again because it took ages as well for an Uber to even confirm. Oh my god, I look so freaking sweaty. I've just seen myself. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so what was I going to say? We were going to get food from Moe's because we really want to try queso, mm -hmm. like the queso dip. Um, but the queues obviously were just crazy everywhere in City Walk, like they have been the whole time basically. So we were still pretty full from lunch, so we saw cinnamon. Cinnamon. Cinna oh. <laughs> <laughs> losing the will to live we saw Cinnabon on the way out and got some Cinnabon so I'm going to eat that now and then we're going to go to bed and then hopefully we get an express pass forks crossed we get an express pass tomorrow so we can go on all the rides on in Islands of Adventure in the morning because we've gotten all the ones we wanted to do in uh, Universal today oh and you want to buy an E.T. toy? Yes, I do want to buy an E.T. <laughs> toy for Buffy that you'll probably chew up in within five seconds. <laughs> so yeah, we need to come up with our list. We need to come up with our oh, restaurant. Oh, we need to do another list. Yeah, we've been doing daily lists on my notes to what we're going to achieve. And we've ticked off everything oh, and have. more today. We did spells <laughs> with our new one. We bought ones. We did spells throughout Diagon Alley. We got a shark oh. puppet cocktail, which was great. What else did we do? Did all the rides we want to do in the yeah. evening, sat chilled in the sun and had a cocktail. Yeah, another ultra strong cocktail. Yeah, from that evil frozen drink bar, but it just tastes so good, so. Spent hours queuing for lunch. Yep, literally probably over an hour queuing for our lunch, it was ridiculous. We longer for lunch than we did any of the rides today. <laughs> yeah, and we waited until six o'clock to even go on our first ride because the ride queues were so nuts all day today. Because <laughs> we'd spend the time before that queuing for lunch. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Priorities. <laughs> so yeah, hopefully we can get an express pass and then we can just blitz through our dino rides. You an express pass for food. You do. You did. I hope that express pass is valid. If we do manage to get one for the price of it, I want to be express passed through all the food queues. I think that's fair. Like voodoo donut. I wanted a voodoo donut. The queue literally went round the corner like a million miles when we were coming out of the parks, and it was basically like that all day. I know you can mobile order. We forgot to do that. <laughs> so to be fair, is it our fault? Probably. Anyway, I'm going to eat this cinnamon bun while it's still warm. Oh, you gonna have a fag scratch these biscuits up here. Oh man, got my lays. Got my lays. Oh, which one did you go for? Classic. Oh, oh classic, classic, you. classic, <laughs> classic, 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 
snail shell. Snail's face. See, not his head. <laughs> Good cinnamon bum. Yeah. It is, isn't it? <laughs> oh, tomorrow morning we're having cinnamon bun bites, vice coffee. Yeah. Because you've been converted to iced coffee now. Yeah. I didn't even... Ugh. I drank coffee like every now and again. But at home, but barely. Barely. <laughs> <laughs> but iced coffee in America is so different. It's so sweet. Like, it has such a good flavour. Mm. Oh, it's so good. Trying this one now. Ooh, nice leg <laughs> bending shot. <laughs> oh my god. Mm. Right, I'm gonna eat this now. I'm not a massive fan of how the Americans always put the calories next to everything on the menu. No, I don't need to see that. <laughs> it feels like um it's unnecessary. It feels like a um <laughs> an insult. Yeah. Like before you order it, do you wanna order that? Like five thousand calories. Yes, yeah, I, I do, do, actually. On the side with that, yep. <laughs> <laughs> yes, I do. Alright, I'm going to eat these, chill out, and then be up early. And oh, we've got to book our shuttles. Oh, oh yeah, scan the QR code. Scan the QR code, do our list, check out restaurants. We've got a lot to do. Oh, yeah. Got a lot of, got a lot of things to do. Right, we'll, so, <laughs> we'll see you in the morning. Good night! Man, we're probably freaking out right now. Yeah. What has happened to my feet? So, it's literally traumatised up. Right over to that line for me. Fantastic. You're okay, don't worry. Bye!